to Retro Rivals. Uh, we're going to talk about a game that we just played like a couple days ago. Yeah. It is called Blazing Chrome. And for anybody that hasn't seen Blazing Chrome, um, I would compare it a lot to the Contra series. Yeah, which we also played. I had to break you in. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. They're hard. Yeah, well, the NES versions are they're hard, but they're not. Was I supposed to be able to differentiate between any of them? Because they were all hard. Yeah, they were hard. They were all hard! But I find when you get up into the next generation console, the, Super Nintendo yeah. and Sega Genesis, they got that much faster. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, that was the problem I always found was trying to run away from anything. It just, they were coming at me too fast. I had I had no chance to think. It was just uh, like, no. do it or you're dead. <laughs> now, the good thing about the Blazing Chrome game, it is very similar for graphics as the... Uh, is it Contra 3? That's the Super I Nintendo. think so, yeah. And um, Hardcore for the Sega Genesis. Very similar in the graphics. Yeah, it was. But you can change the difficulty level. Yeah. Which was good for both of us. Yes. And I should mention right now before I forget, oh, I have to apologize to Phil because our first time we played yeah, the game and game captured, down. the game capture didn't work. It, dropped tremendously in frames per second there, yeah. and we just couldn't use the footage at all. Yeah, we so, wanted to. We wanted to. She got suckered into doing it with I me. did. I did. <laughs> yeah. Well, we should mention when it was released, I guess. Yes, pretty recently. Yeah, July 11th. July 11th this year. And the developer is? Joy Masher. Joy Masher. Yeah. Uh, Brazilian, I think. Is it? Studios, yeah. I've never heard of them. Um, I've actually seen gameplay on this on YouTube. Mm -hmm. And I was like, wow, that looks awesome. I said, Phil, Phil will be all over that because Phil's a big Contra guy. Yeah. yeah. And, and he uh, hadn't heard of it. And he hadn't heard we of it. We were like, we were keeping a secret He's, and he what? didn't know about it. What is this? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's pretty awesome. awesome. Yeah. Yeah, but um, it was released uh, across four different uh, platforms. Yes. Which was nice. Um, Xbox One, which is the one we That's played. What we played on, yeah. Uh, PlayStation Four, uh, the Switch, mm -hmm. and also for PC. PC. Yeah, yeah. So I mean, Commerce. you don't have to. All the bases. Yeah, yeah. pretty much. If you yeah. don't have one, you have the other. And if you don't, you can ask your parents. Yeah. <laughs> if you enjoyed the Contra series from before, you're definitely gonna enjoy this. Yeah. It's the, absolutely. It's, it's awesome, and the fact that you change the difficulty makes it. Easier oh, to play, yes. especially if you're a first time player. Yes, first exactly. First time playing Contra. Yep. So. Well, what we noticed um, was that with the easy mode, you got seven lives. Mm -hmm. And with normal mode, you got five. And with difficult, you got three. And what I noticed against Contra was there wasn't a whole lot of option for many more lives. You, you can put a cheat in. Yeah and get your 99 lives, oh, that, but we didn't do that. No, we didn't, but we'll, we didn't. We'll I'd back. like to, yeah, I'd we'll like to try back. it again. We'll go back and put the, we'll put you, the code in and we'll get How far do you think I can get should, with 99 you lives? You should be able to beat, beat <laughs> the game with 99 lives, you should. I don't know, I could maybe get halfway. Yeah. <laughs> I kept dying. I mean, I, I played the one for the Sega Genesis and the only way I got through that was with our son. Chico. Oh, I, yeah. We needed Chico. Yeah, you and Alex played it at we one need, point. Yeah, I needed Chico. And you guys beat it? And, well, we had Chico on it. Oh, okay. But the, the graphics are amazing. The yeah. sound is awesome there. It's, oh, God. It's yeah. my favorite. I don't know. If, it's not the first Contra I've played, but that's my favorite. Yeah. And it's ice. I swear it's the fastest. I don't know. People will correct me, but I find it very high pace. Which Contra was it that we were playing that we finally got through one level and then all of a sudden we're in a level where I'm like, okay, we're playing a side scroller and then all of a sudden Top it's not down. a. <laughs> top down. That's the one that's uh, for Super Nintendo. Okay. Yeah, it's a top down. I think you use your, your bumpers as like yeah, to turn. Number one. Right. I didn't even know, or was it on the, was it the hardcore one? I can't remember, but they no, might've both had that. No. Either way, I didn't even know my controller had bumpers. What do I, how, how do I, how oh, do I move? It's your bumpers, your bumpers, you gotta turn with your bumpers. The things on the top? Yeah, what do you mean the things on the top? I don't, okay, okay, how do I get away from them? Oh, I already know. How do I get away from them? He's like following me, like, and I'm just like walking around in a circle. I, oh my God. Uh, uh, 
I'm not good at that. First. Because I've never played with bumpers. I'm like, A, B, jump, Super like, Nintendo. Shoot. Come on. I, like, the games oh. that I played on Super Nintendo were, Donkey you know, Kong, Donkey Kong, Mario, Mario yeah. stuff. Yeah, you didn't need bumpers. Okay. No bumpers. All right. Whatever, bumpers, whatever. What did you, what did you think of the uh, Contra and the Super C for the NES? They, to be honest with you, they were all so hard, they all blended together for me. Well, I, those two were very similar. Right? Yeah, they were graphics. really similar. And you, I'm sure if we put game footage side by side, oh, you can yeah. really tell the difference. Uh, well, that's no. the thing. I should throw it up side by side and see if yeah. anybody else can tell the difference. I guess if yeah. you're a huge if Contra you, yeah, fan, I you think, would automatically I'm know. No, but if, if you weren't, if you didn't play them. Exactly, you know, exactly graphics are pretty much the same. I am telling you right now though, like I'm happy you broke me in with the Contra. Those were difficult, but enjoyable. Yeah. Really, really fun. So that when we put Blazing Chrome in, oh my God, we didn't play much of it, but what we it did play- an hour. Yeah, yeah, but I'm saying like, as far as like getting through so many levels, yeah. we didn't, you, you were, had a handicap, kind of had a bit of a <laughs> handicap with you and, and having me as a partner. Well, when I had Phil, I was a handicap, so, <laughs> so I know how Phil feels now. But my favorite part on that entire thing was when the helicopter comes along. So you're holding on oh, to the yeah. helicopter, so and then you're in the helicopter. You're, you're in the mech suit, on running the on mech. The, I'm hanging onto the helicopter, <gasps> and we're shooting. Yeah, Just, that's awesome. Oh, that was amazing. Yeah. Every time, because well, we died a lot. <laughs> Yeah. And those two big bosses at the end. Uh, every time we had to redo the helicopter, I was like, oh, we got this. We uh, got this again. Yeah. It was yeah. so much fun. Contra is one of those games. It's about repetition yeah. and memorizing that you have to know what's yeah. coming up. Yeah. Which Contra was it that we played that we had fallen in the drink? In like the we drink? Could, uh, in the water. You sure it was lava, uh, water or was it lava? No, we oh, have, yeah. the very you first can't, one. You can't jump across when oh, we were in the water all I'm the time. I'm sure you can jump across. I just couldn't We just do couldn't it. do it. No, I haven't Which one's that? Forever. That was the first one. Oh, that was just Contra. That's Contra. Oh, okay. That, yes. Yeah, yeah, we just kept falling in. <laughs> <laughs> when you run through the red water and you eventually get back up. Oh, down. yeah. It doesn't really matter, but yeah. yeah, it was, I found, like, was there any other of them that had water levels like that? Or was that? I wouldn't consider that a water level, but. Well, you know what I mean, that had water in it, because I was. There, there could be. I was surprised by I, that. I was like, oh, cool. Well, I actually It don't, looks a little different. I don't remember. We could go back and play that game and try to play through it. And it would yeah. All, it would all be almost new again yeah. for me, because the last time I played it would have been 30 years ago, you know? So are the Contra uh, characters always the same? I don't. No. No. I really don't know. Well, that's what I liked about Blazing Chrome was with yeah. that we had the option. No. Um, well, you didn't really have the option unless you unlocked those two secret the, characters. Uh, Super Nintendo and Sega Genesis definitely had different characters. Oh, okay. But the uh, Contra and Super C, they might be the same characters. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Because with uh, Blazing Chrome, we had... Call red pants and blue pants. Red pants and blue pants. <laughs> that's the only difference. Yeah, that's yeah. true. Yeah. Uh, with Blazing Chrome, we had Marva and Doyle. Yes. But there was two secret characters that were grayed Doyle out. Doyle rules. <laughs> Doyle rules. Uh, yeah, that were grayed out. Um, we're probably going to mess yeah. this up and completely butcher the names. Well, Suhaila. Suhaila. And Raijin. 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 Yeah. Yeah, so it would be cool to find out how to unlock those characters. I'm sure maybe you just have to play through it. Yeah. Or, or it could be a certain level. Just gives you different level. options. Yeah. From what I had seen was she was like, had a robotic arm or something like that and was some sort of ninja maybe, or he maybe he was a ninja. Either way, we'd have to do a little bit more research on it, but I just, the fact that there was two more secret characters give you it kind of it's some incentive to play through the game to see if you yeah. can get those characters oh, yeah. and how that characters. would change the game. You know what I mean? That would be nice. Yeah. Um, I guess to wrap things up, I would say if you've never played Contra before, this is a good one to get into. Yeah. Because of the, you can change the difficulty levels and it's a little more forgiving. Yeah. And it's fun. It's definitely And fun. it gives you a retro feel 
on a newer console. Yeah. Yeah, because yeah. that's what I loved about it was yeah. you put it on and you, you're you like, I'm playing a retro game. And I think that's yeah. the way they had intentionally designed it was oh, yeah. to play and feel like a retro game, but with more modernized um, game. Like just the, the movement was more fluid. I just it found, yeah, yeah, like you could yeah. actually run away from bad guys before that they would get you. Because if you did, didn't have that just very quick, decisive, you know, if movements. you didn't know exactly what was coming at at, at the time, oh like yeah, you, you you have to play games multiple times to know what's coming. Yeah, if you if you don't do that, then <laughs> they're pretty difficult. It's it's a lot of memorization. Oh yeah, kind of and the music play. was awesome in it too. Oh yeah, yeah, the music, awesome. music across the board in yeah. Contra and Blazing Chrome is awesome. Oh yeah, they're all awesome. Yeah, yeah. I actually don't remember the NES music at Did all. Did we have? Maybe we didn't have it on. We might not have. Yeah. I don't know. Okay. Don't know. We'll have to go back and play it and see. <laughs> yeah. Well, we're going to go play some more of that now. Yeah, I think we have to. Oh, yeah, we have to. We owe it to it. Yeah. We owe it to ourselves oh, and Contra yeah. to play it some more and Blazing Chrome. I was, well, I was talking about Blazing okay. Chrome. Okay. I would rather play Blazing Chrome. <laughs> I like the Contra, don't get me wrong, but Blazing Chrome is a yeah. little bit more forgiving for yeah. someone that's well, new to it yeah. like me. So yeah. if you're new to it like me, try it out. Try it you'll, out. I think you'll really like yeah. it. All right, till next time. Uh, like, subscribe, and comment if you guys want to see more of this kind of, yeah. not really a tutorial, but a kind of a game review. Game, yeah, kind of get game a review. game review. Yeah. yeah. Some newbie game review. Mm -hmm. All right. Definitely newbie. <laughs> uh, till next time. All right, see ya.